ready. All right, here we go. The rematch between Dustin Poirier and Conor McGregor as round one gets underway here. And I got to think if you're Conor, this fight is happening in a different division. It's happening more than five years later. Got to throw out the film on act one, correct? You have to throw it away. You have to look at this as a different fight. Because the first time Dustin Poirier was not a champion. He was not a guy that had been to the top of the mountain. Right. Now, Dustin has accomplished so many things. Conor has to view him as a completely different opponent. And you know Conor McGregor prepares as hard and as well as anyone. He has done his homework as he tries to make it 2-0 in his rivalry with Dustin Poirier. Well, he continues to stay busy. What do they say, DC? Punches in bunches? Punches in bunches. He's landing them upside his opponent's head over and over again. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? He loaded up there on that high kick. Oh, big elbow. Oh, big left hook there. Oh! All right, so one minute into the fight, we've got a full-on brawl here, DC. It's great for the fans. Not necessarily for the gas tank if this thing goes much longer. Not great for the gas tank and not good for the old noggin. You can't ah. take so many upside the head. Somebody's going to sleep. Rock him, suck him out of the suit here. Oh, just misses with the kick. All right, so a nice straight punch there after he caught the leg. He decides to punch out as opposed to going for any takedown. Look at the force behind that leg kick. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. So we pull up the stats for you now. 32 total strikes have found the mark for Conor McGregor. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. He got him. Whiffs on the right hand. Well, you're starting to see the damage now bleeding from his cheek. Poirier gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. You got to check these low leg kicks. Oh, how good is that Poirier jab? He's got huge hands and certainly was able to find the home for his jab there. I mean, the kick of Lafayette has got it going tonight. Dustin Poirier fights in the southpaw, but he's a right-handed guy. That's why that jab does so much damage to his opponent. Try to establish that jab. Big powerful punch land. Now he gets back to range. And both guys really throwing with authority. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. He is throwing a fast, straight, hard jab. That's not a feeler jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. All right, so he lands another jab now, just snapping that thing off. Oh, back to the straight punches we've seen all night. Huge straight punch lands, and he's got him hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves the moment. Don't finish his fight. Oh, big knee to the body. That'll soften him up. It's another huge knee. Oh, nice. Both guys landing big shots. But that punch, no good. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. How good is that right hand? McGregor's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Great punch. Oh! He's hurt. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. He's done, he's done. What a fight. Just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end.